Sundiata Keita was the founder of the Mali Empire, which was one of the largest and most powerful empires in Africa. He was born in the early 13th century to a noble family in the Mandinka kingdom of Kangaba. Sundiata was a sickly child, but he was also very intelligent and ambitious. He grew up to be a skilled warrior and a charismatic leader. In the early 13th century, the Mali Empire was ruled by the Soso people, who were led by the powerful king Sumanguru. Sumanguru was a cruel and oppressive ruler, and he enslaved many of the Mandinka people. Sundiata vowed to overthrow Sumanguru and restore the Mandinka to their rightful place. Sundiata gathered an army of Mandinka warriors and marched on the Soso kingdom. The two armies met in battle at Kirina in 1235. Sundiata's army was outnumbered, but they were victorious. Sumanguru was killed in the battle, and Sundiata was hailed as the new ruler of the Mali Empire. Sundiata ruled the Mali Empire for 20 years. During his reign, the empire expanded to include much of West Africa. Sundiata was a wise and just ruler, and he promoted trade and learning. He also established the Mandan Charter, which was a set of laws that guaranteed the rights of all people in the empire. Sundiata Keita was a great leader and a visionary ruler. He laid the foundation for the Mali Empire to become one of the most powerful and prosperous empires in Africa. His legacy continues to inspire people today. Sundiata Keita's story is one of courage, determination, and triumph. He overcame many obstacles to achieve his goals, and he left a lasting legacy on the world. His story is still told today in the oral tradition of the Mandinka people, and it has been the inspiration for many works of art and literature. Sundiata Keita is often referred to as the Lion King of Mali. This nickname is a reference to his strength, courage, and leadership. He was a true hero of his people, and his story is an inspiration to people all over the world.